Capricorn, welcome to CS Tarot. We're going to dive in. We're going to get the next 72 hours in love. We're going to see what's going on with you, okay? If you're new here, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know if this resonates. I am open for personal readings and all of that information is down below in the description box. If you haven't checked out your Sexual Magic Deep Dive for January, check out my page and... Uh, Check it out because it is a juicy one, okay? All right, Capricorn, let's dive in. Let's see what's going on in love over the next 72 hours. Spirit, please show me clear and accurate messages for the sign of Capricorn. What is happening in love over the next 72 hours for Capricorn? Please show me clearly, Spirit, for Capricorn. their eye on you Capricorn first out page of swords seven of pentacles someone's watching and waiting here Capricorn okay two more please spirit you could even have your eye on someone and you're waiting take it how it resonates okay the queen of cups longing here longing for you or you're longing for someone One more please, Spirit, for Capricorn. Ooh, we have the Temperance. Bottom of the deck, we've got the Seven of Wands. So Capricorn, underneath that, we have the, uh, the Page of Cups. Someone here, <clears throat> Capricorn, <clears throat> excuse me, whether it's you or someone on the outside looking in, someone is watching you very heavily. They're using a lot of patience. They even have their defenses up a little bit here, okay? Again, it can be you. Somebody here has their defenses up a little bit. They're being a little bit guarded, but they wanna come closer to you. This looks like a, a brand new person here, Capricorn, okay? So this person, um, I feel like they're infatuated with you, all right? They're longing for you here with the Queen of Cups, desiring you, okay, sexually or otherwise. I feel like this person is very different from you with the temperance card okay I feel like this person's like this person's an opposite of you or this person's very different from you okay um, but this person is hoping to move closer to you I feel to me like this person's waiting for the, per per the perfect time because this person is watching you this person could be watching your social media this could even be someone that you work with here with the seven of Pentacles not necessarily so but someone Capricorn someone has their eye on you Okay. I feel as if they're infatuated with you as well. Spirit, show me more. <laughs> that just fell out. Okay, so on my, uh, it was just funny the way it flipped out. So first of all, bottom of the deck, you have the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. What fell out on the Page of Swords is the Nine of Pentacles. So Capricorn, this person is seeing you in a really abundant energy. This person is looking at you like damn shoddy, okay? This person is finding you very, very attractive. This person thinks you're beautiful. This person thinks you're just, wow, okay? This person is blown away by you, especially with the Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck. Look at that energy. It's like this person's looking at you like you are the winnings to a lottery ticket, okay? This person is looking at you like you have it all, okay? You're probably, like, you're definitely, I, I mean, I'm imagining you're single. If you're not, then someone is still watching you, even if you're not. Um, that could be why this person has their defenses up. If you're in a connection, that could be why this person is not approaching you because they're, you know, they're thinking that it's not going to go their way, but... I feel like this I feel a sense of intimidation from this person if I'm gonna be honest with you like I think they're putting you on <clears throat> I think they're putting you on quite a pedestal here especially with that wheel of fortune I'm feeling an energy of being very attractive there's something about your face there's something about your face that really draws this person in obviously you're a whole package here with the nine of Pentacles if that's how they're seeing you but there's something very 
unique about your face that this person is they're in awe of okay again it can be the other way around you could be looking at someone like this all right let's do let's get the seven of pentacles So we've got the five of wands and the two of pentacles that flipped over together for that seven of pentacles. So Capricorn, <clears throat> bottom of the deck, chariot. This person is waiting to move towards you. This person, this person is determined to come towards you, but they're, they're a little hesitant. There is competition here. Okay. I feel like a lot of people are vying for your attention at this time. This person knows that. And this person with the two of pentacles, seven of pentacles, it feels like this person is like, it's not quite the right time. So this person is standing strong in their defenses as it stands. <clears throat> They're not making a move as it stands, but they want to. They want to have you here. Chariot energy, strong sexual attraction to you as well. Okay. This person is heavily desiring you for sure. Okay. In a sexual manner, manner and otherwise. All right. Let's get this Queen of Cups here for Capricorn. Queen of Cups, Capricorn. I just seen the judgment. <laughs> um, Queen of Cups for Capricorn. The Six of Wands. Wow. Oh, man. Bottom of the deck, we have the Magician. So this person is trying to... Look at this. Queen of Cups, Six of Wands, and the Magician. This person is trying to score. <laughs> okay, I'm going to keep it a buck. This person is trying to score. Um, I see a lot of sexual energy here, okay? This isn't a sexual reading, but I do see a lot of sexual energy. This person is longing for you, very thirsty with the Queen of Cups. This person probably has a caring energy for you as well, nurturing. Um, this person is putting you on a pedestal for sure. I feel like there are a lot of people vying for your attention at this time. Okay, Capricorn, you're highly desirable at this time. Let me just say that. Um, but this person is, this person is very much longing for you. They're very thirsty for you. Okay. They want a victory with you. They want to know what you taste like, what you feel like. Okay. Um, there, you are drawing this person in, whether you know it or not. There's something, there's something about you that just this it turns this person right on okay this person is trying to manifest you this person is trying very very hard to manifest you this person is sitting in their tower watching you in secret okay and wanting to come closer to you this person is waiting this person sees you're very popular though. There's a three of cups right here. This person sees that you're very popular. This person sees that you probably have a lot of pe people that are interested in you. But this person, this person wants it. <laughs> this person's got it bad. No Usher Raymond, okay? Let me, let me put, um, let me get this temperance card. I need the temperance card for Capricorn, please, Spirit. Temperance for Capricorn. Ooh, a lot of energy. So, we've got the Five of Swords. We've got the Eight of Pentacles. Bottom of the deck, we've got the Nine of Swords. Okay, so this person... It's like they're waiting for the right time, but they're overthinking it. This person's in their head a lot. I feel like this person is like borderline obsessing. If I seen the devil, I would definitely say this person's obsessing. But this person has you on their mind a lot. Like this person cannot stop thinking about you. I feel like this person's having anxiety and overanalyzing the situation. They're feeling quite pessimistic. Um, they're trying to figure out the perfect way to approach you here with the Eight of Pentacles um, and the Temperance. It's like this person is really... They're feeling a little pessimistic with the Five of Swords, but they, um, they're they trying to find the perfect way to approach you. And I feel like they're spending a lot of time, yeah, look, underneath that, the Ten of Wands, and then the Knight of Pentacles. Like, this person, it's slowing them down. The amount of anxiety that they're having, um, as much as they're thinking about you, it's like they're, they're, they're psyching themselves out, is the energy that I'm feeling here, okay? But this person, this person cannot stop thinking about you, Capricorn. It is wild. This person is trying to figure out the perfect way 
to approach you. Again, this could be you trying to approach someone else. Show me that seven of wands, please, Spirit. Seven of wands for Capricorn. Seven of wands for Capricorn, please. <laughs> the lovers. Bottom of the deck, the Knight of Cups. This person, this person wants to give you this offer. This person wants to give you a romantic offer. This is a beautiful combination. What's come out here is the lovers and the Knight of Cups. So I don't think this person only wants to have a sexual encounter with you. I think this person um, is watching you, wanting you as a potential partner. That's how this feels here, okay? I feel like there's a very real attraction to you. Um, this person... This person can see themselves falling in love with you here is what I'm seeing, but there's this defensive energy. So clarifying the seven of wands, we have, like I said, the lovers, and then at the bottom of the deck, we have the knight of cups. Capricorn, this person is going to make a choice to bring you this offer, okay? So... I feel like they're going to be moving out of this seven of wands here. I just feel like this is a temporary defensive energy, but they are going to make the choice to give you an offer is what I'm seeing here. So this could be the next 72 hours. It could be 72 hours before, 72 hours after. Well, not 72 hours before now, but I feel like it could fall within 72 hours after type of energy. Um, but I do see this person, Capricorn, giving coming to you with a romantic offer. Um, I feel like this person has been watching you for some time. Um, and I feel like this person is starting to feel like they're going to miss the boat if they don't, um, if they don't make their move. Okay. All right, Capricorn, this is what I've got for you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know if this resonates and I am open for personal readings. Um, and all of that information is down below in the description box. Love and light guys.